What's good with y'all boys? As always, quick update video for you guys today. You know, today is a huge day for the Opium Playboy Cardi fan base, as we were just given the tour dates for the Antagonist tour. As said in my previous video, the Billboard first appeared in London shortly following the Wireless Festival. Now, about a week later, the tour dates have dropped, and the tour will be starting in early September, with the first show being in Denver, Colorado on September 6th. Now, this is significant for a number of reasons. Uh, the first being with Ken about to drop a great chaos. That leaves one Opium member who hasn't dropped music in the last year. Of course, we got If Looks Could Kill, From Lone, Snot or Not, From Homicide Gang, and now Great Chaos from Ken Carson. Well, the last person to drop is, of course, the founder and CEO of the label, King Vamp, Playboy Cardi. Now, one would logically think that since all the other artists in the label have dropped recently, it must mean that something is coming from Cardi, but obviously since we are Cardi fans, we know not to believe the logical and most likely occurrence to happen. That was until the Mercedes-Benz Arena in Berlin posted this to their website as a description to their show for Playboy Cardi on November 30th. So this was straight from their website. On the subsequent albums, Die Lit and Whole Lotta Red, he collaborated with numerous greats of the hip hop scene, such as Kanye West, Travis Scott, and Nicki Minaj. After the release of his new album, Music, the 26-year-old exceptional artist will go on Antagonist Tour in Europe this autumn. We are pleased that he is also visiting the Mercedes-Benz Mercedes Arena Berlin in this context. So basically what this means is that Cardi said to drop his new project titled Music, likely before the tour, or sometime along the tour. So that would be roughly about 50 days until he drops, 50 to 60 with the first date being September 6th. Now, shortly after the website deleted this section and people are crying and moaning about how it's fake and that now means he won't drop. If anything, I believe them removing it solidifies the claim of him dropping even more. Cardi must have saw it and you know, saw it was gaining traction on Twitter and stuff like that. And then he simply told them to take it down because he wanted to be the one who announces the release of his own project. So yeah, uh, Opium Tour starting about two months. Can't wait for the Ken and Cardi drop. And Cardi fans, you know, we are closer now than ever uh, to that new project. So close, you know, we can taste it. It's been almost three years, you know, we're starving, but we are so close. If you can try just to hold on a little longer, we all know it will be worth it. Uh, let me know in the comments if you guys think this is nothing or something in regard to Cardi dropping. And what shows do you guys plan on going to? As always, like, comment, and subscribe if you want to, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace.